Hi, ako si Melvin Rapas. Kung mahilig kayo sa ganitong content, health tips, tutorial, and lifestyle, i-consider nyo ang Mel Raps TV to subscribe. Dahil may matutunan kayo dito na mga idea patungkol sa ating kalusugan at sa iba-iba pang mga bagay. Top 10 foods that boost the immune system. Number 10 is green tea. Green tea is a type of tea that is made from Camellia sinensis leaves and buds that have not undergone the same withering and oxidation process used to make oolong teas and black teas. Both green and black teas are packed with flavonoids, a type of antioxidant. Where green tea really excels is in its levels of epigallocatic egalit, or RGCG, another powerful antioxidant. Turmeric. Turmeric is a flowering plant, curcuma longa, of the ginger family, Zingiberaceae, the roots of which are used in cooking. You may know turmeric as a key ingredient in many curries. But this bright yellow, bitter spice has also been used for years as an anti-inflammatory in treating both osteoarthritis and rheumatoid arthritis. Number 8 is Almond. The almond is a species of tree native to Iran and surrounding countries, but widely cultivated elsewhere. When it comes to preventing and fighting off colds, vitamin E tends to take a back seat to vitamin C. However, vitamin E is key to a healthy immune system. It's a fat-soluble vitamin, meaning it requires the presence of fat to be absorbed properly. Nuts, such as almonds, are packed with the vitamin and also have healthy fats. A half cup serving, which is about 46 whole, shelled almonds, provides nearly 100% of the recommended daily amount of vitamin E. Number 7 is Yogurt. Yogurt is a food produced by bacterial fermentation of milk. Look for yogurts that have live and active cultures printed on the label, like Greek yogurt. These cultures may stimulate your immune system to help fight diseases. Try to get plain yogurts rather than the kinds that are pre-flavored and loaded with sugar. You can sweeten plain yogurt yourself with healthy fruits and a drizzle of honey instead. Yogurt can also be a great source of vitamin D, so try to select brands fortified with vitamin D. Vitamin D helps regulate the immune system and is thought to boost our body's natural defenses against diseases.
Number six is spinach. Spinach is a leafy green flowering plant native to Central and Western Asia. Spinach made our list, not just because it's rich in vitamin C. It's also packed with numerous antioxidants and beta-carotene, which may increase the infection-fighting ability of our immune systems. Similar to broccoli, spinach is healthiest when it's cooked as little as possible, so that it retains its nutrients. However, light cooking enhances its vitamin A, and allows other nutrients to be released, from oxalic acid. Number 5 is Ginger. Ginger is a flowering plant. Ginger root is widely used as a spice and a folk medicine. Ginger is another ingredient many turn to after getting sick. help decrease inflammation, which can help reduce a sore throat, and other inflammatory illnesses. Ginger, may also help decrease nausea. value in fighting infections. vegetables you can put on your table. Thank you. 
Number two is red bell peppers. The bell pepper is a cultivar group of the species Capsicum annuum. Bell peppers are sometimes grouped with less pungent pepper varieties as sweet peppers. Red bell peppers contain twice as much vitamin C as citrus. They're also a rich source of beta carotene. Besides boosting your immune system, vitamin C may help maintain healthy skin. Beta carotene helps keep your eyes and skin healthy. Before we reveal our number one on the list, please like and subscribe. Ring the bell notification for more videos. The number one on our list is citrus fruits. Citrus is a genus of flowering trees and shrubs in the root family, Rutaceae. Plants in the genus produce citrus fruits, including important crops such as oranges, lemons, grapefruits, pomelos, and limes. Most people turn to vitamin C after they've caught a cold. That's because it helps build up your immune system. Vitamin C is thought to increase the production of white blood cells. These are key to fighting infections. Thank you for watching, see you on the next video.